in the maroon. And we're off and underway. It's a healthy crowd inside the uh, Winchmore Hill Cricket Club this afternoon. Retrieved by Rhys Jones, who plays it short, but it's a terrible clearance and a chance here for an opening goal. And somehow cleared away. Wonderful opportunity. Can he get the cross in here, Russ? Uh, Josh Taylor. He does get the cross in. Just too high. For uh, an appeal for a penalty, certainly there. Keys to take. Slips over in the process. Headed towards goal and off the bar. And then in by Pigeon. Time for the free kick. James Lamb, the crea creative war horse in the middle of the midfield. Up towards Coombe, stamps it back. Shot coming in from a distance from Antwerp. There's a chance here to make it two from Pidgeot. Oh, that's an excellent challenge. But it's still falling here to Gibbs. Great save by the goalkeeper, Gibbs again. And across the face of goal, I'm very close to being two. So it's a corner once again here to Crouch and Vampires. They've had plenty of them in the first half and they lead here by a goal to nil. Geeves clips it in. Again, the goalkeeper gets a punch to it. Down goes. At the moment, you have to say that the scoreline is a fair reflection of what we've seen of this game. Half time is fast approaching and there's a chance for Pidgeot. And Pidgeot. Half time just round the corner. And certainly Crouch and Vampires will be the happier of the two teams. Leading here by a goal to nil. Ball into the box. Very, very nearly number two as well. Taylor. Can they skip back into this game on the stroke of half time? Into the chest of Coombe. Not the easiest of balls for Coombe to have to deal with. Coombe again. And then the shot over the top of the crossbar. In the box involving Jack Lawrence. Pushing shoulders with Holmes. In comes Gibbs. His free kick in the end, quite tame. Continue to apply the pressure on Crouch and Vampires. Throwing into the box up towards Coombe. Couldn't quite get a head to it. Struck towards goal. Took a deflection on its way through. It was a decent strike on the volley from Steve Young. Gibbs with the corner. Right swing up, headed down and just wide of the target. One to chase for Fraser. Holmes. Pocket pick though there, Holmes. Door up. And the shot coming in from Fraser. Straight at Reese Jones. It was to get the ball forward here for Bridgemore Hill. Towards the edge of the box and a Opportunity to get the shot in there for James Townsend. Corner on the opposite side, which means that uh, Taylor's had to run all the way the width of the pitch. He's whipped in towards the back post and try. Driving forward is Cove. Back really a bit there. The shot coming in from distance. Looking for distance and Pigeon has found Newell. Newell gets the cross in towards the penalty area and a chance maybe here for number two. Just wouldn't come down for Gibbs. Bobbling around there. Couldn't quite come down for Wing and there's a chance of a breakaway here and a chance for Fraser. He's onside. Couldn't get enough energy. Behind. Is there to be a late turn? No, there's not. There is the final whistle. And it's Crouch and Vampires that take the AFA Junior Novitz Cup final.
little bit of protocol. We want the captain to come up last. Thank <laughs> you. 